So I want to take this opportunity to share with you how you can maybe start to overcome some common problems that people face when it comes to their well-being, their health. Common challenges that many people can relate to and the simple solutions that I share with the people that I work with, people I speak with, getting them back to feeling and looking their best, performing at their best, being more productive, being more profitable and really living a life full of freedom and vitality. Now, often, and this may be something that you can relate to, that people's daily lives are plagued with these challenges in terms of their health and their fitness and their well-being. So things such as low energy, back pain, feeling anxious and that sense of anxiety all the time, the mindset where there's, you know, continually self-sabotaging themselves when it comes to things such as their food and their diet. And these problems, unfortunately, have become the norm for many people. And this may be something that you can relate to. The issue that we have is that we have a health and fitness industry that presents people with solutions that don't really solve these issues. And long term, people don't seem to be overcoming and these problems are something that they become live with every day. You know, the solutions such as you have to become a gym bunny or you have to rely on medication, you know, long term. Uh, supplementation, which is not always the right supplementation of low quality and doesn't really offer a solution to building up the body in a strong way. Having to maybe go to a gym where you feel embarrassed or you're not really confident or having to commit to doing really extreme hard workouts, which for many people, it just doesn't sit well with them. Um, So these are the solutions that people are being presented with to overcome these issues that we've highlighted But there's a discord. Not many people can fall into these habits of becoming a gym bunny or going to the gym and doing embarrassing workouts. And that's maybe something that you can relate to as well. And we all know what that leads to. It leads to confusion. You know, people still scratching their head on, you know, what to do, who to speak with, which is the best exercise to go for. There's so much misinformation out there. It leaves people feeling overwhelmed and they never change. And it's very frustrating because there's so many people, business owners, entrepreneurs, especially men in their 40s and 50s who, you know, in a position where they feel like, you know, I've fallen out of, or fallen into some bad habits when it comes to my health or I'm not looking after myself the way I know I should, but I want to do something about it. But they're still left feeling confused and that sense of overwhelm. And we've all heard that saying, you know, a confused mind says no, especially a scared and confused mind says no. And that's because this gym centric, this reactive approach that people have been presented with in the health and fitness industry is just not working. So what's the solution? Well, the solution is a real solution and something that I share with my clients, people I speak with, and that's over working nearly three decades in the health and fitness space, I've discovered secrets for helping busy men in the 40s and older 50s, get them stronger, more energized, to get them feeling younger, looking younger, without spending long hours in the gym. And that's a problem for many people that they don't want to be living in the gym all the time, but they want to get themselves in a position where they're feeling stronger, they're feeling more energized, they're feeling more vitalized. And just following the real solution can help them do that. And what does it involve? Well, We keep it super simple, as you know, over here, Real Simple Wellness, and we get them to practice holistic, integrative practice. Yeah, we make it hip. (laughs) Yeah. Keeping it hip keeps it super simple. And by keeping it hip, we help men and women over 40 get stronger, more energized, more attractive without spending hours in the gym. So people go from that position where they're feeling flat, um, full of self-sabotage, to enviable all their energy and they have concrete confidence. So there's no more confusion. They have clarity on what they need to do to get themselves in a position where they're feeling strong and feeling confident when it comes to the fitness and well-being. And they're living a more vitalized life. So how do we do that? We coined this term, we get them to become confidoctivity. 
or we get them to become confidentive. And it's a term that we've kind of coined where we've combined the word of confidence and productivity. And it's a state of being, if you think about it's being characterized by high levels of confidence and productivity. We combine those two words that lead to them being effective and efficient and achieving their goals. So confidentive or becoming confidentive, this is our objective to get you to that place. And how we do that is by following a real simple method called the real wheel. When you apply the real wheel, you can roll through life with less struggle, with more confidence, more clarity. So when life does life, because life will always do life, you're in a much stronger position to deal with those situations. And it's just a four step method. First of all, we get you to realize, take responsibility, get in a position where you know exactly what you need to do in order to get you feeling more energized, getting that body stronger, getting that mental resilience up. Then we'll talk about eating right. You'll overcome that confusion when it comes to your diet and nutrition, knowing exactly what you need to eat to fortify your immune system, get yourself healthy, get your digestive system working optimally so you've got that all day energy, doing what's right for you. Then we talk about becoming active, physically active, the right type of activity, the right type of exercise that fits seamlessly into your working week, into your daily activities. So you're not having to think about it. It's doing what is right for you so you can be consistent. And we know that consistency breeds results. And then finally, we talk about love. Now, it's important that you do love what you do because if you're going to adapt and change and improve and upgrade and upskill, it has to be something that you love. I've learned over the years that the people who are more successful is finding something that they do on a regular basis because they love what they do. Now, that's different for everybody, but we'll discover with you what your love of labor is so that fits into your week, it fits into your schedule and you're doing the right things moving you closer towards your goals and that's a real will those four simple steps where you're realizing taking responsibility eating right being physically active on a consistent basis and learning to love what it is that you do and that's it real simple when you're adopting that real simple will you roll through life with that self-assurance that you know that anything that comes up in your life any issues any problems you can tackle those. So any goals that you have, burning off unwanted belly fat, beating that self-sabotage, becoming more productive, building a strong, resilient body, and living a life full of vitality and finding freedom through fitness can be yours when you just follow this four-step approach, following the real wheel. And that's what we do over here at Real Simple Wellness. Keep it super, super simple. Now, if you feel like that's something that you want to learn more about or learn how you can begin to integrate this progress, process into your life and how you can start on your journey, there'll be a link down here around this video somewhere. Just click on that link and we'll schedule a time to talk about you and how we can help you start on your real wheel journey. All right. Hope you found that beneficial. We'll talk soon. Take care.